We're gonna jump right into the fun and the magic. Today we're at Disney World here in Magic Kingdom. I have my family with me today. I have my cousin and his wife and their three cute little kids. And we are dealing with an almost a year old, almost a three year old and a five year old. So it's gonna be full of princesses, fun and fantasy. And a little faith, a little trust, and just a bit of pixie dust. May all of your wishes and dreams come true. Looking for somewhere to get pixie dusted, you'll go to Sir Mickey's. It's right here in the Fantasyland area by the carousel. You talk to one of the cast members in there about some magical pixie dust. For those that are five and older, the pixie dust, sorry, three and older, the pixie dust is visible and very sparkly. For those that are two or younger, the pixie dust is extra magical and can only be seen by very special very special pixies. So that's Sir Mickey's. I'm so tired right now. <laughs> <laughs> this trip we decided to bring our own food. So a fun little place that I like to go when you're just wanting to eat or get away from the crowds for a minute. And you can hear the parade starting in the background. But it's in Liberty Square and it's right behind the Christmas shop. So if you go to... <laughs> so if you go to where... It's... So there's the Liberty Bell. And across the way, that's the Haunted Mansion over there. And you turn this way, and it's just this perfect little spot that's usually quite quiet. And there's tables back here, a cute little gazebo. This is where Santa Claus is during Christmas. And yeah, we're just setting up for our sandwiches. The parade started early, unexpectedly. I was hearing it in the background, but I was like, it's not supposed to start for another 10 minutes. Joke's on me, it started, so. The two little girls and I just ran to the parade and we got there just in time to see Anna and Elsa and all the other princesses and it was so stinking cute but I left my phone behind so you just have to trust me it's a great parade. Festival of Fantasy usually there is a uh, fire effect coming out of the dragon. That's loud. Real Disney you know you hear the beeps in the background. Usually there's a fire effect coming out of the dragon, but they didn't have it this time, unfortunately, but that's okay. It was good, it was still awesome. And now we're just finishing up lunch and using the bathroom. We're at the bathroom by Casey's Corner. So if you can find your way back to the hub and you see the red and white striped umbrella, you've made it to Casey's Corner. And if you just follow the umbrellas down, you'll see this little walkway next to the first aid and baby care center. And then bathrooms are just right there. Pretty clean and pretty nice. Um, fairly busy though. So not my favorite restroom to use, but it is a solid option when the need arises. The story of all their bad Oh, I can hardly wait. Are you all ready to try to the story? Yes! yes. Wonderful! And we have enough parts for everyone! First, we need two- Quickly now, quickly! Belle's almost ready, which means she will be here soon! You have the hardest part of all! Throughout the entire tale, don't move! <gasps>
to Hollywood Studios and we're about to sing with Anna and Elsa. What else did we do today? Um, we did the Disney princesses. We saw so many Disney princesses. Did we see the dinosaur at Hollywood Studios? Yes. Yeah, what did we name the dinosaur? Do we name it Ellie. Julia? Yeah, and Juliet. And Juliet. She has two names, Julia and Juliet. But now we're gonna go to the sing along. Yeah, this is what happens when you bring one jacket. <laughs> and you have three kids. <laughs> okay, now it's bedtime. Um, our day kind of came to a little bit of an abrupt stop when the rain got really bad. So after we did the frozen sing-along, we made it over to Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway. And then we did Toy Story Mania. Um, and I held the baby so that the four older members of the family <laughs> could have a little friendly competition on the ride and then we were planning on going to Fantasmic but the rain was just really bad so we left and I took them to a backstage cast parking area where we watched the Epcot Forever fireworks <laughs> um, just from our car because we wanted to have a nice fun fireworks ending to the day and now we're home <laughs> warmed up dried off showered nice and clean um and going to bed so good night